Let's take a look at how to adjust the animation speeds on the S7. So what I'm going to do is open up my settings. I'm going to swipe all the way over into the system tab. And you'll notice down at the bottom of the screen I have developer options. I've already enabled this menu by default it's hidden, but I'm going to show you how to enable it. If it's not being shown, what you do is you enter about device. And then right here where it says actual build number, what you do is you tap on there multiple times. You notice whenever I tap on there, it says developer mode has already been turned on, but you're going to have to tap on it probably about 10 times. It'll actually give you a countdown. And once you've done so, the actual developer options will show on this menu. Now, when you enter developer options, there are a lot of things in here that you can do. And the reason that this is hidden by default is because this is honestly only for developers. You shouldn't come in here and mess with anything really, unless you're trying to do something as part of a development. The thing that I like to change though is down here about in the middle of the menu is the window animation. I can actually change my transition, animator, and the window animation scales. By default, they're set to one, but if I set it to 0.5, everything happens pretty fast. Notice if I set it animation down to scale of 10x, I try and open up this window, notice how slowly the animation comes in at 10. If I turn it off, you're gonna notice that when I open this window again, there's absolutely no animation. Even the same thing happens for transitions and animations. So if I enter my multitasking now, you notice there's no animation at all. But if I was to set my transition animation scale back to 10, notice when I enter my multitasking how everything happens really slowly. And even if I come back into the settings, notice it comes in really slow. So I like to come in here. I found that 0.5 gives me a nice animation and it still is really quick. So now if I enter multitasking, you see there's a 0.5. Let's set my transition back to say one and open that up. You see it's a little bit slower, not much, but that 0.5 difference does make everything seem a little bit snappier. Now the phone itself isn't acting any faster, it's still using everything the same, it's just the transitions are happening a lot faster so that way I can get through things a lot faster just through the actual UI of the system. And again, if you don't want any animation at all, just come in here and turn everything off. Now notice when I enter my multitasking and there's no animation at all, it just jumps. And the same thing when I open a menu, it just happens to jump on the screen. So I wouldn't really mess with anything else in this developer options. There's really not much in here that you should mess with. I just like to come in here and change my transitions because it does make the phone seem like it's running faster. And I'm able to get through different menus and options on my phone a lot quicker by uh, shortening the animation speeds and scales. For more videos like this, be sure and subscribe to State of Text YouTube, and we'll see you in the next video.